Welcome back to Gopalas Public School online classes and myself Mrs. Ranjana Koshal and today my lecture is for classes 3rd, 4th and 5th and my topic is simplification and my topic is simplification. In my last lecture what I have explained, I have explained the 4 basic operation of mathematics that we general use that is addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. How to solve questions if addition, subtraction, multiplication and division occur in a simple single question. But if question is asked in another type, for example, addition, subtraction, multiplication and division is asked in single one question. That means one question containing plus sign also, minus sign also, sign of multiplication also and division also. So how do we solve these types of questions? So these types of questions are known as simplification and to solve these types of questions we use two types of rule. Odd mass rule and second is bod mass rule. So first what is odd mass rule? Odd mass means O is stands for O is stands for of B is stands for division, M is stands for multiplication, A is stands for addition and S is stands for subtraction. So if in this type of complicated question come then first we will do the OFF operation. Now you have never listened about the OFF operation. So what is the meaning of OFF operation? The meaning of OFF operation is multiplication. For example if it is given that 6 of 7. Then what is the meaning of 6 of 7? The meaning of 6 of 7 is 6 multiplied by 7. 6 multiplied by 7 is 42. So if in simplification question if of comes then the meaning of O is of. That means you have to multiply the two number between which the of is written. Now the second is D. That means division. If in that question division is given, then our next preference goes to division. After dividing, if in that question multiplication is also there, then our next preference will be multiplication and then we subtract and then, uh, sorry, then we subtract and at last we do subtraction. Okay? So, O is stands for of, that is multiplication operation. D is stand for division. That means our first preference is of. Then we divide. Then we multiply. Then we add. And at last what we do? At last we subtract. Okay. So I will solve one question. See. I will solve one example. Uh, example is 81 minus 12 of 3 divided by 4 multiplied by 6 minus 8 plus 19. So, this is my question. So, according to Ormos rule, our first preference goes to of. That means of. So, is there of in this question? Yes. So, where is the of in this question? Here. So, in, in place of of, what we will place? The sign of multiplication. So, the rest of the question will be as it is. 81, then minus, then 12, then in place of, of what we will write here? Multiply. Then 3 will become here as it is. Then the sign of division. Then 4 multiplied by 6 minus 8 and plus 19. So, first we will do the multiplication. That means of operation. So, we will multiply these two numbers between which the sign of multiplication is given. And the rest of the number will be come down as it is. So, 81 will become as it is. This minus sign will be as it is. So, 12 multiply by 3. So, 3 2 are 6 and 3 1 are 3. So, 12 3 are is 36 and the rest of the numbers and sign will become as it is. That is division. Then 4 multiply by 6 minus 8 plus 19. Okay, so we have done this of operation. So I cross it. Now our next operation is D. That means division. So is 
there division in this question? Yes. Where? Here is division. Here is the sign of division. So between which two numbers the sign of division is there? Between 36 divided by 4. So we divide these two numbers and rest of the numbers will be copied down as it is. So it will be as it is 81 minus. So 36 divided by 4. So in the table of 4, 36 come how many times? 9 times. 4 nines are 36. So if we divide 36 by 4, what we will get? What we will give? We will get, we will get 9. So in place of this, we will write here 9. And the rest will be come as it is. Okay. So division is also done. So I have lost here D. Now our next preference is M. M means multiplication. So is there sign of multiplication in this question? Yes. Here, here is the sign of multiplication. So we multiply these two digits and the rest of the number will copy down as it is. So 81 minus 96 96 54. So in place of this multiplication I will write here 54 minus 8 and plus 19 will come as it is. Now our next so no more multiplication of sign is there. So I put cross here in place of multiplication. Now our next operation is addition. So here the sign of addition is there and two subtractions. So if more than two addition or subtraction sign are there, what we will do? We will add two positive number, two two numbers having plus sign and the number having negative sign also we added. That means we do the addition of plus sign, the number that having no sign, the number that uh, be, uh, the number uh, before which no sign is written, that means that number is positive, that means plus sign is there. For example, 18. So here no sign is written, that means this is plus sign. So this is plus sign and this is plus sign, plus number, positive number and positive number. So positive, positive number we, we will keep it together, 81 plus 19 and two negative number, that means two number having the subtraction sign, we will put it together. Okay, now what is the next step? We add the number having plus sign and we add the number having minus sign also. The number having negative sign also we add and the number having positive sign also we add. So if we add 81 plus 19, what we will get here? We will get here 100. And now the sign of negative will become and if we add 54 plus 8, 54 plus 8 is 62. Now simple negative sign is there. Now we will minus 8. So if we minus 100 minus 62, what we will get? 38. Okay. So this is a question of simplification which we solve it using odd mass rule. Now our next rule is odd mass rule. Odd mass, odd mass rule is also similar to odd mass rule but only one more thing is added here that is B and this B stands for bracket. What this B stands for? Bracket. That means in this simplification question, some brackets will be there. There are three types of bracket. The bigger bracket is known as square bracket like this. And the bracket that is inner, inside the this square bracket is known as curly bracket. And the bracket that is inside this curly bracket is known as simple curve bracket. So this is larger bracket, this is curly bracket and this is inner bracket. So if three types of brackets are there, the first, our first difference goes to this simple bracket. We solve inner bracket first, then outer and then at last outer bracket. So B stands for bracket. Again O stands for top, D stands for division, M stands for multiplication, A stands for addition and S stands for subtraction. Okay, the rest of the operations will be same. So in odd mass rule, our first preference is bracket. If bracket is given, so first we will solve the bracket. Then if op operation is given, then we will solve the op operation means multiplication. Then we will divide, then multiply, then addition and then subtraction. So it is mostly similar to odd mass rule. Only the new thing in this odd mass is only the bracket. That means first we solve the bracket. So we will solve one question of odd mass rule also. I am writing here one example. 
this is my question so according to what my rule what is our first first preference our first preference is b that means bracket so is there bracket in this question yes two brackets are there one is this curly uh, bracket and second is small bracket so what is our first preference in bracket also we solve the inner bracket first so how many there are two inner brackets this and this so simultaneously we will solve two inner brackets okay so first i am solving these two inner brackets and this will be written as it is 3 minus this curly bracket will also as it is so 38 plus 2 the sign of plus is there so between these two small brackets what is written here 38 plus 2 so we will do it 38 plus 2 so 38 plus 2 is 40 and what is the sign here division so i write here division then i will again solve this what what is given written here written here is 98 minus 73 so what is the sign here minus so i will subtract these two numbers so 98 minus 73 so 8 minus 3 is 5 and 9 minus 7 is 2 so here will be curly bracket close now what is the next step what is our next step our next step is this is 12 okay this is 12 so sorry so it will become 50 50 this is 12 so it will become 50 50 now now our next step our next step is again bracket because bracket is written here so first we will solve the bracket so in this bracket what sign is written here division so first we will divide these two numbers so if the rest will be written as it is so 3 minus 50 divided by 25 is 50 divided by 25 is 2 so here will be 2 what will become here here will be 2 now simple 3 minus 2 is 1 so our answer is 1 in this way we solve the odd mass rule we solve the question based on odd mass and odd mass rule i hope